WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, 30th of, of March. We're looking at one more day to go to get that closing candle for the monthly chart. So far, the Dow's up 50 points at 35,344. It would have just seen been a natural thing to have some kind of a pullback today. But I did have a Chapman Wave a trend gauge reading, a high reading that suggested there should be at least a 9 to 11 point rally in the S&P from some kind of a low. Well, we've certainly got that because the S&P right now is trading down just six points at 46.25, having been down to 46.14. Very nice nine point move on the upside. And we're looking at yesterday being a leg D at 46.27.63. Can we get above that today? I want to see that candle close fabulously by tomorrow, Thursday at 4 o'clock for the monthly March candle in the S&P. We're looking at the QQQ, uh, being a little weaker earlier on, still down about $1.50 at 369.90. It's an all egg B and the chapter methodology, a buy signal that gets upgraded to a buy mode, which it did at the close yesterday, suggests there should be a C and a D, four higher peaks. We've got that in the down the S and P. So the lagging uh Index so far is the IWM, just in terms of the notation of the Chapman Wave uh, methodology, and you're still you're in a leg D in the IWM, trading at 211.53, just down a tad. If we can get to the 215s by next week, that's going to be really good. Gold had a big move down. Today it's rallying some. It's up 20 at 19.37. Stuck in a range in this lower range. Um, I think it's just consolidating huge gains. We're looking at crude oil, same thing. Uh, let me just show you something very interesting. If we go to the, uh, let me just do this quickly if I can. There it is. So if you can go to the 10 minute chart, if you're looking at crude oil, what a nice rally from earlier this morning uh, from the uh, 104.55 level. The continuous contract goes to the 200 period moving average. You get stuck there. Finally, it breaks out. Now it's at 108. And look at gold. Gold's doing the same thing. Gets stuck at the orange 200 period moving average in the 10 minute chart. Now it's moving up nicely. It's up 20. And the TLT, and that's the big issue here, is the TLT is trading down 30 cents, 130.44. That's going to be an issue, and, and yields are still very high. So you can anticipate higher heels still to come.